And me lying about it would only catch up to me because I have girlfriends that lie about their age. You know, those girls that are like, 30 is the new 20. <laughs> 40 is the new 30. I'm like, no, it's not, no, it's not. <laughs> I know, I, what kind of math are you doing? Because <laughs> I don't see any 20-year-olds walking around going, oh my God, I'm 10, guys. <laughs> <laughs> This new math is really confusing me. <laughs> and there's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong with it. If you accept the beauty of getting older, there's nothing wrong with it at all. There are certain things that chicks do, I think, to kind of make it like easy for them. Like I have a girlfriend that's dating a younger guy and she's calling herself a cougar, which is awful. <laughs> I hate that because she walks around and she's like, I'm a cougar. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you're an idiot. Stop talking. <laughs> Let me just explain to you, I don't judge you. If you're an older woman, you date a younger guy, hey, that's good for you. Do what you have to do. I'm not, I don't run your life, but just don't liken yourself to a predatory animal. <laughs> How does that even sound appealing, ladies, that at some point you're gonna be so hard up for man meat <laughs> that you have to hunt it? And you gotta hunt the younger ones because their legs are weaker and they don't run as fast. <laughs> <laughs> because older guys can sense the crazy coming. They'll be like, is that Sharon? My knee's acting up. <laughs> I just got hit on by a 19-year-old. No, no, it wasn't sexy. Stop. Let me explain how it happened. I was on the subway. All my fun stories happened on the subway. And this guy, I, you know, he was approaching me. He's all thugged out, like baggy pants, baggy shirt, like a fitted cap, all thugged out. And I could see him out of the corner of my eye, like approaching me. Like, you know how you notice when somebody, you can feel when someone's going to hit on you, right? It's like, I was like, dan it, dan it, dan it. I could feel that happening. <laughs> the closer he got to me, I was like, no. And I have to give him credit because he approached me with like the swagger of like a grown man. Like he was like, I'm saying, ma, let me get your phone number. <laughs> and I was like, no. <laughs> and he goes, why come I can't get your number? Well, let's break down that sentence, first of all. <laughs> That's your first clue. <laughs> so I told him, I said, you know, I think I'm too old for you. And he said, well, how old are you? And I, I said, I'm 33. And you could see the damn in his face. <laughs> like, that was the oldest age he'd heard up until that point in his life. Like... <laughs> He couldn't fathom how I'd made it 33 years on this earth. And then he tried to make it better. He's like, I'm saying you don't look 33, ma. <laughs> and I was like, well, thank you, but should I have like a hump and a lazy eye to help you out? <laughs> like next time he sees a girl with a hump, oh, she 33. <laughs> That's when they get they hump. <laughs>